Black History Month meets Power City. A civil engineer retired after three decades at Chevron Phillips, but her work is not done yet. She now serves as the chair of Golden Triangles Texas Alliance for Minorities in Engineering. And as Cameron Seibert reports, she's using her experience to inspire the next generation of engineers in Southeast Texas. I'm a little kid. I pretty much knew I was going into science. Annie Carter is many things, a scientist, leader, and creator, but most of all, a trailblazer. If you're in a career where it's dominated by one gender or the other, it's sort of how you handle it. In 1980, Carter became the first African-American female to earn a Bachelor of Science in Civil Engineering at Texas A&M University. There's nothing about engineering or science or technology that says it's a male career. So we program ourselves, we program our children to think it is. I was 100% comfortable working in that area. She proved her comfort quickly, earning a job at Gulf and Port Arthur right out of college and climbing the ladder at Chevron Phillips. Carter started in maintenance before becoming a manager, eventually leading teams on multi-million dollar projects. Whether you were a female or what the ethnic background, if you could deliver on the work, then you, you got the jobs. But perhaps her most meaningful work has not been at refineries or chemical plants, but in classrooms and convention centers. And why did you choose to take your sticks and put them through like this? Just in case. Um, something no, it's, a, door, it's a good idea. For over 30 years, Carter has worked with the Golden Triangle for the Texas Alliance for Minorities in Engineering, or TAME. She's now the chair of the board. Mainly because there are not enough children who are first generation, children of color, females that feel comfortable in the workspace. So if they get introduced to it, hopefully at an early age, it knocks down a lot of barriers. TAME teaches minority students science, technology, engineering, and math in fun ways. The lessons inspire and prepare. Uh, it's just so important to help close that gap. If you can make a difference for one child, that's, you've done it. You've done good. Carter has made a difference for thousands of children. We uh, interview them for jobs. When you see them as professors on ca college campuses, uh, when you see them owners of businesses, and so you, you begin to check off those boxes, yes, you made a difference. Nothing inspires a child quite like a first-hand example of how the hard work pays off. In Beaumont, Cameron Seibert, 12 News.